Hey, hey everybody, this is Larry. This is day 11, I want to say, of the Lico Day Challenge. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, join me on Discord. Let me know what you think about today's poem. Today, I was a very long day. Uh, I did eight easy miles, but honestly, I was just so dehydrated. It was about 90 degrees out. Uh, what is that in Celsius? Uh, 32 degrees Celsius, and I was just not hydrated enough, so I did not feel good. Um, but I did it anyway. And now I'm here, still dehydrated, but doing a poem. So let's take a look at today's poem without further ado, and I will probably, I don't know, see what happens. Uh, my apologies preemptively if I am not 100%, but you know. Uh, Meldon training season is coming, or it is here. It is week, oh yeah. This is week six, so week six just finished. I did 40 miles, uh, which is about, what is it, 65 kilometers more or less. Um, so, and it only gets more, so, uh, and tougher, but, you know, I survived, but I really want to do this poem so that I could go back to my bed and then just chill and rest out. Anyway, let's take a look at today's poem of 2438, Range Product Queries of Powers. Given an integer n, there exists a zero index array called powers, composed of the minimum number of, power of powers of two, that sums sum to n. The array is sorted in non decreasing order, and there's only one way to form the array. You're also given a zero index 2D integer array queries where a query survives, legal left survive, rate survive, each query survive represents a query where you have to find a product for a powers of J, where if uh, left survive is less than equal to J, less than equal to right survive. Okay? Right? Got it so far? I didn't, but I read it. We did it in a way answers equal and link to queries. There's a mod thing, so I always do this like little mod song and just put it in. Uh, I mean, this obviously gives me a wrong answer, um, but it'll make me remember it if I le did not do it, right? In any case, answer, link your queries, answer survives, okay, obviously. Uh, if it's too large, oh, ten, mod this, okay. I still don't understand what, do, what I'm doing, but okay. Let's take a look at some examples, okay. N is equal to 15. What's that mean? For positive... This is composed of the minimum number of powers of... Okay, so that's kind of this. Uh, the way so in non-decreasing order, there's only one way to form the way. I mean, okay. Yeah, if it's sorted, then... Okay. So this is just like the binary indexes. Or you could say... Um, yeah, the... Yeah. In binary, the number, the index of the ones or whatever, going from least significant digit up. Right. Uh, left survive, right survive, we define a product of power sub j. Okay. So 0 and 1 is equal to just 2, okay. Uh, hmm. I mean, yeah, I don't think there's anything too tricky. I think the, the key thing is noting that n, for every number n, there are only dirty numbers, right? And so you can do dirty num, you know, you could do, well, you could multiply dirty numbers back to back, right, with 29 multiplications, very straightforwardly, right? Um, it should be fast enough. If we have to optimize, we can think about optimization like a prefix some e thing or something, but I don't even think that's even necessary. So yeah, so basically you can, um, yeah, we just construct the array, right? So maybe we have a, doo -doo -doo -doo. Uh, maybe, maybe I'll just write the other way actually, because it makes more sense with this one. So I think technically, eh, whatever. Uh, let's say 32, right? So if n and do, 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 one, do. this is just the bitwise way of saying that if the i bit is a one, then uh, what's it called? Oh, uh, well, yeah, sure, whatever. Right? Yeah. Hmm. I'm just double checking real quick. Why is pa Why is fifteen? Did I mess something up? Minimum number of powers. To minimum. Did I misreading? Minimum number of powers of two that sums to n. Oh, 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 this, I, I, I'm, uh, okay. Actually, I was wrong. Um, in that, 
Yeah, for some, I mean, I, I said it wrong too out loud. That's why I was so confused. I thought these were supposed to be indexes, but then no, they're just components. Meaning that instead of appending uh, i, we want to append two to the i, right? Okay. So actually, not that. I mean, still not too bad, but you know, uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Though they are all powers of two, so you can actually. I mean, I mean, I was just looking at this, but I think that couple of ways you can do it. You can look at it this way. Um, yeah, I mean, I don't, I think that's maybe fine. I don't know. You could also just store the powers of two. Then you could just sum up the, the, the powers and then do a mod power, which maybe is faster. Um, and then from that, you could also do a prefix sum easier. But again, this is dirty numbers. Um, prefix sum and all these things. It doesn't even matter. I don't think. I could be wrong though. So yeah, so SE and queries. Um, yeah. Uh, is S always be oh left is always great. I mean this used to be a trick that people did is that um you have to or like as a problem setter, so, uh they used to do like oh you have to do you have to find the answer between the two queries, which technically they could swap them, which is not not a it's not even like an interesting trick, but sometimes they didn't, so I don't know. Uh, so so I look for it sometimes just to make sure that I didn't make that silly mistake. But yeah, is this why I didn't make this? No, doo -doo 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 -doo. Nope. Right. Uh, what's it called? All oh, sub i. Right. Pretty straightforward. Um. Oh, whoops. Still pretty straightforward, just not correct. Okay. Uh, oh, did I not? <laughs> Whoops. Uh, yeah. Uh, let's go quick sum it. If I have a silly mistake, then that's fine. Yeah, I mean, you could do better, like I said, with prefix sum and a mod pal, but, you know, it's fine. This is 10 lines of code or whatever, 15 lines of code. And I am tired. What's the complexity, though? Um, this is, like I said, this is at most dirty multiplications. Um, even though this looks maybe possibly expensive, but it never actually gets to a big num, right? Because um, the biggest number is 10 to the 9, I think. So that's like 2 to the 30. And so this is going to be at most 2 to the 30 times another number that's 2 to the 30. That's 2 to the 60. You mod it so everything fits in long, long or 64-bit int in, in if you're using like a C++ language type thing. Um, but yeah. Um, and then, yeah, then it's just O of Q, right? So, yeah. Uh, that is all I have for this one. Let me know what you think. Thanks for watching. I really need to take a break on the couch with the AC on. Uh, stay good, stay healthy, do your mental health. I'll see y'all later and take care. Bye-bye.